heartbreaking to everybody and it's so shocking. Sad that there's two teenagers involved in this. A local community is coming together to support the family of a teen who was shot over the weekend. Good evening to you and welcome to News 10 Night Watch. News 10 told you earlier about a 17 year old who police say was shot on Saturday. This happened at a house on Shelby Street in Vincennes. Officers arrested a 15 year old. Initial charges include criminal recklessness, dangerous possession of a firearm and dealing in marijuana. Police have not released information about why officers arrested the teenagers or the teenager rather. They also say they haven't released the names of the people involved because they are minors. However, friends and family on social media say the victim is Avery Pond. News 10's Jada Huddleston was at a fundraiser earlier today that helped support the Pond family. She joins us with more from family and friends. Yeah, Rondrell, I spent the afternoon at Swirls Frozen Yogurt. Now many people were in and out all day. There were even lines of people at some point to get yogurt. I spoke with one of Avery's family members today. She says the support from the community has been overwhelming. Lena Foreman is Avery Pond's cousin. She says she can't believe something like this happened to her family. And I got a text message from somebody and I was just shocked. I'm like, no, this ain't, you know, this couldn't be real, you know. And it's just something you don't expect, especially, you know, such young kids. It just really rocked the whole town. The whole town has come together to support the Pond family. That includes the fundraiser at Swirls Frozen Yogurt. The owner says he knew it was the right thing to do. Um, he just seems like such a such a nice kid. Um, it's such a such a nice, you know, asset to the community. Um, and I just figured we needed to do something to help out and show our support. So this is the least we could do. Not only do they donate all of their sales to Pond's family, community members also wrote inspiring messages on the walls of the shop. It's the support from the tight-knit community that has given the Pond family a little bit of hope. There's been such an outpouring of love and support from so many people. His mom just overwhelmed with the joy, you know, that so many people care about him and that are taking the time to help out and do what they can to help them get through this. Klein says Swirls raised just more than $5,000 for the Pond family from today's fundraiser. Now, if you couldn't make it out today, there's still ways to help. We've linked you to more information on our website, WTHITV.com. Back to you.